Welcome back, friends. We are almost done with this solar plexus self-care class. Um, I just wanted to cover a few more tools and ideas before we go dive into this beautiful meditation I'm going to lead you on. So some other tools that you can use in your tool bag for energy and spiritual and emotional healing um, is journaling. Go write your feelings out. You did a little bit of that hopefully earlier in class. Um, sound healing is amazing. So whether you're using like tuning forks or sound bowls or even like um, drumming, oh my gosh, is amazing. All of those things are vibrational and they can totally clear you out and uplift your spirit. The more you are engaged with your spirit and allowing her to really come and embody and be part of who, who is the leader of your life, the higher your vibration is and the better that solar plexus is going to feel. So really connecting to music is powerful whether it's even just boot like booty dancing out on the floor with your girlfriends or dancing to some um pandora or spotify while you're making dinner so just use music as a beautiful tool for your spirit it's a great way to even create music is a great way to express your spirit and really embody your inner goddess who is trying to voice and create her way through this life so that's another beautiful healing tool so don't ever discount music and sound healing um, like we said, massage, reflexology, cupping, stretching, acupuncture. Um, a lot of people use like salt baths. Like if you use Epsom salt, like totally going in and taking a bath and totally doing meditation while it. Oh my gosh, you can just totally add oils, crystals, everything. It is totally great. So um, salt baths really help to uh, neutralize our energy and our aura and um, really setting those intentions um, while you're taking your bath and really acknowledging what you're releasing. Like we said, crystals are amazing and great, like yellow calcite, um, citrine, um, carnelian, or even just um, some Himalayan salt. Um, those are amazing. Don't put the Himalayan salt in your bath, though. <laughs> you can also use um, foam rollers and tennis balls. If you watched my sacral chakra class or the um, root chakra class, you can have seen some foam roller and tennis ball action going for releasing those muscles in our body. Um, Reiki, yoga, um, and the biggest thing is just mindfulness, women. So... Those are some other tools you can be using. And next, we will kind of be going into our meditation. So I'm going to have you kind of get comfortable. And maybe whether you're seated or laying down. <sighs> I just need to take a breath to ground myself. So maybe you can start connecting to your breath too with Breaths in and out. Breathing in and out. Imagining breathing in those big, beautiful breaths all the way into your body, into your root, into your belly, into that solar plexus. Like, really imagine bringing in all of that beautiful energy within your breath. If you have your oils today, you can grab any one of those, um, lemon or citrus fresh, orange, tangerine, um, any of the oils be listed emotionally if you want to pause this and go grab them. Mm, we talked about valor, peace and calming, clarity, live your passion, inspiration, or if you don't have your oils, it's totally fine. Mm, just keep taking some breaths. As your body slows down, your energy slows down a little. You tap into your mindfulness. Mm. I want you to put your hands on your belly. If 
you have your oils, go ahead and place it right in that midline underneath that xiphoid process and above that belly button, all in that whole area. Rub it on your sides. You can reach around and rub it on your mid and lower back. If you have your oil, you can bring it up to your nose and inhale her. Breathing out any tension or emotional chatter as you breathe in and breathe out. I want you to envision beautiful light from the heavens and the universe and the sky above you shining down through the atmosphere and this through the sky. As you breathe in and imagine a, a glowing yellow gorgeous light showering down into your roof and your ceiling or wherever you are. Showering down over the top of your head and falling down on your shoulders. Permeating your hair and your skull and that beautiful mind of yours. Soaking into your ears and your jaw and your nose. Down into your throat. tongue and your teeth. And as this, this golden light showers down on you, I want you to imagine the different areas of your body releasing tension and your muscles becoming softer and releasing as it drifts down onto your neck and your shoulders. into your chest cavity and down your arms into your lungs and it just moves into your belly swirling into your belly swishing around in your belly washing that solar plexus out you can almost imagine water in a bowl just circulating and shifting and moving, like holding a bowl of water and moving your hand, like you'd be swishing your solar plexus out. Maybe even take your hands and place them on your belly and kind of give us some scrubs and rubs all around that beautiful, gorgeous belly of yours. Give her some love. And imagine as you touch her and scrub her and rub her and caress her that your solar plexus is just going brighter and brighter like a beautiful sun or a beautiful star. A beautiful sunflower just opening and sloughing off any muck or dirt or old baggage. All of that stuff that you wrote down is just being flung off and clean and washed out. Oh, take as much time as you need right there, sister. Move your ribs around. Maybe do some side bends. Maybe do some spine rolls. Gentle backward bends. Just work on moving that pelvis around. If you or your trunk around and Imagine that if uh, there is any tension or pain, that maybe take your hands and rub that area of your body. As you breathe in to that pain or that discomfort or tightness within your muscles, give them some love and acknowledgement as you breathe in deeper into that space. Breathe in that air and that beautiful divine light deeper into your belly, all the way into your womb. 
as your inner goddess continues to awaken into her beautiful glory and power, imagine that light soaking into your root and into your butt, into your hips. <sighs> Breathing in. You can even do a few Kegels, some pelvis movements to kind of loosen this lower half of your body as that divine light just starts to really soak and permeate into your legs, into your thighs, into your hips and your knees. Breathe in and move that light into your calves and into your feet, into your toes. Breathing in and imagine that light is just showering from your head, soaking through your body, swishing around in that beautiful solar plexus area, down into your legs where it starts to soak into Mama Earth. I want you to envision that divine light and all of your old stagnant emotional energy and all that baggage just soaking into Mama Earth, into the ground, into the rocks. As she greets you with her loving energy so she can recycle and transform your old emotional energy and baggage into something beautiful within her creation. So you're being held from above within that divine light. You're being held within your body, held with Mother Earth. I want you to really envision in front of you. Sister, I want you to envision your higher self standing here in front of you. Like your soul is like stepped out of your body. And she, I want you to take a look at her. Hmm, I want you to envision her standing tall with her shoulders back and her chest open. I want you to envision your higher self having a beautiful good hair day and she has a big smile on her face and she just has her hands held around her belly, opening and closing, kind of bringing the energy out releasing it out into the earth. You can even maybe even imagine those words, those memories that you're trying to release, like grab them from your solar plexus and hand them to her. Like you even just have to physically use your imagination, grab them from your body, grab them into your hand and hand them to your higher self who is standing in front of you. Ah, oh, she holds those feelings and emotions that you've experienced almost like a baby. Caressing and honoring and loving everything you've been through, sweet sister. And I want you to imagine her lovingly placing them into the ground for you. Releasing anything that's no longer serving you. Hmm, as you envision her digging into the soil and placing all of your troubles and memories and hardships, I want you to imagine her patting that ground and blessing it to create any new life that you're seeking to create in your life. Breathe in creation into your belly. Breathe in vitality. Breathe in laughter and joy. As you imagine your solar plexus becoming brighter and brighter and brighter, glowing in yellow, I want you to listen mm. to a few of these words. Say them to yourself, sweet sister. I can achieve my goals. I can achieve my goals. I am a creator. I am a creator. I can create the life that my heart is whispering for me to create. 
I can express my authentic self. I can be the leader of my own life. Sister, you are the leader of your own life. I am the leader of my own life. I am my own leader. I am capable. I have a beautiful intuition and gut instincts. I can listen to my body and my heart and my intuition as she guides me to lead this life that I'm creating. I bless myself with vitality and strength. I bless myself with fire and light and sun and alignment and abundance and joy and silliness and playfulness, creativity. I bless my spirit, my leader, my power, my fire, my goddess to come forward and lead the life I dare to dream to create. Breathe in and out. I want you to just really feel held within this bubble, within this shower, with the universe holding you exactly where you are, setting these intentions, sweet sister. As you breathe in and out. If you have your oil, you can drop another drop into your hand. I want you to harness in some gratitude and joy and honor for yourself for all that you just released, everything you are setting intention for, and being the leader and motivation and discipline and creator of all that you are trying to create, sweet sister. And as you do that, I want you to inhale that oil, create your scent temp. Mm. Really bless your face and your head, blessing your energy. Coming back into your body, moving your muscles and your shoulders and your toes and your feet around. Come back into this space, come back into your body. Mm. As you bless all that you are, dear one, you are so loved, you are so held. I want you just to sit with your smile and sit with your intentions and this feeling and join me on the next video. Love you.